Nowadays, they're saying that it's a really good idea to get bored, that it's actually a doorway to creativity. I'm bored. It's not boring. Bored is our new superpower. Do you ever get bored? I mean, like, really bored, like, mind-numbingly bored. No, you don't. Nobody gets bored anymore, not in these super social TikTok times. You've lost the knack. Back in the day, we used to get proper bored. We only had four TV channels. We had no internet. We had no phones of our own. If you wanted to phone a friend, you had to get on the landline and your mum was never having that. No, you can't talk to Felix. She's not done her homework. Goodbye. We knew how to get bored. I suspect you know about that study where people were left in a room with no phone, no pen and paper, nothing, just their thoughts. Except for there was also a device in the room that could administer an electric shock. And a surprisingly high number of people administered themselves an electric shock rather than be left with their own thoughts. Yeah, I know, it's, it's shocking. The thing with boredom itself, it is actually quite an unpleasant state. I think it's because people just aren't used to being bored anymore. But the point is, boredom leads to daydreaming. And daydreaming leads to your brain connecting things in different ways, brings new ideas. Research shows that as you move from boredom into daydreaming, your brain goes into default mode, where it starts to make all kinds of interesting neural connections, and associates new ideas in all kinds of interesting ways. And it also just gives your brain a rest which is another thing that's missing these days. Another good thing with boredom is it can actually bring change. I think that people got very bored with prog rock and that brought about punk. If you start to notice that people just do things the same way and it bores you, what's the, what's the way that you could do something different? Another way to use boredom as a force for good is to help you do something you want to do. If you leave your guitar or your bass out or your door on with your software set up, and then do nothing for a bit, you'll probably gravitate to actually doing something. If we never get bored, and we never start to daydream, and we never get into default mode, who knows what could happen? We might never have a good idea again in our life. That would be sad, wouldn't it? I do suggest you try it, because number one, you're giving your brain a rest. Number two, you're actually getting used to spending some time on your own. Number three, Hopefully you're actually going to start daydreaming and having some creative thoughts that you're not having before. And also, you might just bore yourself into doing something fun, like playing your guitar or getting programming. Bored is your new superpower. It's completely free and something you can do at home in your own time. Who knew that we'd want to be bored? I'm bored. I'm the chairman of the board.